Hello, you look so wonderful and beautiful, and I'm so glad to see you both. Um, I'm still getting used to the Zoom world. Sean, I'm really glad that you're okay. Oh my gosh, you had a head concussion, that's intense. Um, yeah, you both put on a really good um, presentation. I've learned so much. So awesome, just wrapping my head around more things I didn't know and relearning things that both were explained to me and you both present really well. So um, yeah, thank you so much. So um, yeah, I, I honestly love both of these, um, both of these souls. They have um, really catapulted me into taking responsibility for my healing um, and actually like putting the power back into me, which is really empowering. I mean, that is just to say the least, you know? Um, I remember one of the things that Sean, you said, you said, you know, we're all made of matter, like we can heal anything. And that was so true. And Rachel, you told me like this device will only amplify the only things that you are doing. Um, and so I just want to speak and say that, yeah, it takes a lot of other things too, right? Like this isn't like the one, the one quick fix. Um, but really everything that Sean and Rachel, we, what you were both saying um, throughout the presentation, like speak so truly, right? Like we kind of tap into these frequencies and it's like, oh yeah, everything's like clean and clear, you know? And it's just like, it's like this ultimate, like stepping into like this smooth silk, like world and it feels so beautiful. And um you know, I really started off doing the, using the frequency and the scalar um, energy with cord, cord cutting. That was like my big start. I had bought like an ebook from someone that's more like works in the astral light code world and was kind of waiting for the right timing to kind of get that going. Cause that was pretty new to me. And so I was, yeah, putting these different um, healing modalities together and it really amplified everything. And also made me realize that like, you know, you keep saying 0, 0.0.0. 0. 0. It is like getting to that zero point, really. I mean, I don't know what to say. Like, I don't really have anything new to say other than everything that you all are saying, which is just super on point with what I've been going through. I'm not really one that's best able to kind of come up with my own words. I really resonate with other what other folks are saying and just can, kind of really say that, yeah, like it's been working, it feels really good. And I get to play with a lot of different frequencies. Um, you know, the 7.83 is what I've been doing with everything else. I slowly built up from one frequency on, um, and it's just been fantastic. Like, you know, whether it's like, I just, you know, was able to copy down a bunch of the numbers and I just kind of open it up and I intuitively kind of flow with it. And um, I've also been doing a lot of, you know, I was diagnosed with autism um, last summer and depression and anxiety and whether or not we want to attach with those labels or not, like they still are planted in our consciousness and they don't really go away. And so I've been, you know, working with some really high frequency labels more in like the, the, um, the six number digits recently. And I'm rolling with it, you know, and it feels good and I'm happy for it. And the little discs, I also just want to go off what I've said before, like the little discs that come with it. Um, I stick them in my pocket or I stick them in my bra and I go out into the world and I do my, my shielding. And it's just like, it's like a little nugget I got. And so, yeah, it's just been really fun and really cool. And um, yeah, you all taught me a lot more things today that I didn't know. And so it really kind of, you know, whether it was from the respiratory related to 5G, that says a lot for me because I've been having a lot of respiratory issues and I did recently move out of the city. So that's been awesome, I think. Um, yeah, just stuff around like, you know, the 5G activates heavy metal. So just a lot for me more to think about. And I'll definitely be, you know, you'll be hearing from me um, to ask more questions, but. Just, yeah, thank you so much. And um, yeah, again, it's just about, you know, I also met these folks in person um, and right away joined them on the Rainbow Bridge Sanctuary um, and felt really alignment in that with that um, in itself outside of like the scalar energy. And it's just really made me kind of like feel guided and feel like 
my life like, has more purpose and this healing isn't just like a, oh, I'm just going to do this for a little bit. You know what I mean? Like it's more than just doing something and making choice just for a little bit. It really, it really settles you in. And um, yeah, I just have so much gratitude. So if there's anything else you wanted me to like speak to, I think I kind of covered like the main point. So um, yeah, I love you both and thank you. Thank, thank you, you. Allie. Love you, Allie. <laughs> thank you so much. So sweet. <laughs>